in this tutorial we will create a gear mechanism with the help of mechanical mat so let and at the end we will make this simple animation also Le so let's make this simple mechanism in solidworks now let's click on new activate assembly say ok now cancel this all i am going to change background color plain white and unit i am going to change from here bottom left inches now activate this design library if you see in tool nc inches power transmission gear now first gear i am going to take here is per gear just drag it and let's change diametral pitch 0.5 we need number of teeth first gear 40 pressure angle we will keep 60 now the face width the width of gear 15 hub style we will keep none and the di diameter this diameter 10 and uh, there is a key square key you will see here 40 milli 40 number of teeth say ok if you say ok it will again ask you would you like to make more so say just simply click no again I am going to drag one more gear this time everything same but only difference is this has 20 number of teeth rest face width everything same ok cancel now let's activate uh, we will first create one right click make sure this is in floating mode front plane create a sketch and I am going to draw one center line this is for reference purpose now what is the length of this uh, this length going to be 60 inch ok why 60 inch because the diameter of this is 80 and this is 40 so if we make half it becomes 60 just simply exit now here I am going to activate fillet uh, mat first make few important relation like uh, front plane and select this face just check it this is going in wrong direction so simply you will see mat alignment say ok again front plane and select this face here chain alignment make sure this is lies at this plane say ok now before going to apply ok let's apply this point select this now here select cocentric ok similarly for this gear select this end point and select this internal face and see it is going to be make coincide with corner so simply choose cocentric ok now let me hide this I am going to apply some color so it looks better drag yellow color leaf and select body simply green to this one select here body fine ok this is going to be perfect take normal view now let's make one collision view A smart move collision A stop at collision sound highlight just move see the noise means it is going to touch so keep as it is now activate mat go to mechanical mat activate gear and here we have to choose mat 
so i am going to select this face and here this face now by default it is took the diameter of both so i am going to double click and put teeth 20 enter double click on this 40 enter now we selected here teeth okay let's keep this one as it is if we ch make reverse both will move reverse together so let's say okay cancel now let's rotate now look this is perfectly rotating each other now right click go to toolbar edit motion manager go to motion study now here first uh, keep animation this is simple animation so i'm not going to change anything activate motor here first motor type rotary motor component i'm going to select this inside circular make it reverse and rpm constant speed i'm going to select five okay here one option called motion study properties and here choose frame i'm going to make 60 frames so that it will give you a smooth animation say okay now calculate look play see this is how we make a simple animation in solidworks with the help of gear mate i hope you like it don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching